Welcome to Bill Snyder Family Stadium. I'm Jake Chada. This is John Helsley from the Oklahoma and NewsOK.com. Our final score here was 58-35, to 35, a shootout, a, a big half uh, offensively for the Sooners uh, in the first half. Oh, it was uh, a record scored here today by the Sooners for a half, 55 points. It's most ever in program history. That says quite a bit, Jake. The uh, running game was big in the first half, too. They made a lot of big plays. Uh, Broyles even had the punt return the first one in two years. It seemed like everything was going well for the offense. They made all the plays they needed to. And more than that, too, they, they scored uh, eight touchdowns in the first half. Not a single drive took more than a minute 45. Just talk about how impressive to watch them was. Yeah, very impressive. You know, you mentioned the running game. Both backs go over 100 yards today. Chris Brown, DeMarco Murray. Uh, Sam Bradford, his usual self. There were a few drops today, which would have actually inflated the numbers, but it was almost, you know, and the question came up in the post game about being like a video game, and that's what it kind of had that feeling. That was the video game out there today. And the video game uh, style hurt OU's defense, too. Kansas State had a lot of big plays. Uh, they ended up with 35 points, and frankly, could have had 42 49 if they make a couple catches uh, in the second half. Uh, not the best performance from OU's defense. No, you know, it was 28 to 7. Uh, the Sooners were up, and then almost within a blink, it seemed like it was 28 28, and we were in a ball game again. Of course, the offense got it going and kind of blew things open there at the end of the half, but not a great day for the defense. It's kind of hard to get a feel really for, for what the uh, really what the personality of this defense is right now. Usually, you know about a Sooner defense, hard to figure that out right now. Still waiting for that marquee game where they shut down a powerful offense. Really haven't had that yet this year. I know they played well in the non conference, but none of those offenses were. Uh, tremendous like they're going to see in the Big 12. Yeah, and, and this wasn't an offense. While it has Josh Freeman and a few decent parts, it was, really wasn't an offense that had been tearing it up. Uh, they only scored 13 points last week at Colorado. It was a home game for Kansas State today, so you can kind of give them a little boost there. But I really didn't expect that sort of offense out of them today. All right, thanks, John. Our final score here again, 58-35. Thanks for watching NewsOK.com. This is John Helsing. I'm Jake Trotter. 